Well, good morning, one and all. It's Saturday, the 20... Oh, I can't remember what it is now. <laughs> oh, I'm not very good at starting these videos, am I? It's 8 o'clock in the morning on a Saturday. I am heading for, and hopefully arrive safely at, Margate for a second visit in, a, in a, about four or five weeks since the Margate meltdown. And this visit is to, you know, take some pictures of a bunch of scooters and take me back nearly 40 years, early 80s, to uh, so when I used to preen myself and my scooters, I had plural. Um, I just take, go back a little bit to when life was a bit easier, no internet. <laughs> Maybe I'll do this or either one. So I've got my Cine 8 out and did it on that, but hey ho. Anyway, so that's what I'm doing. Now the way I'm going is a bit bonkers really because I'm adding an hour onto my journey. But it is 8 o'clock, I don't really need to get there until about 11ish when the um, when the indoor custom show starts in the uh, main area, the dream world or if it is dream land or anyway. So I thought I'll take this opportunity to do this video in two parts because some of you have complained that some of my videos are a little bit long. I mean, you could chop to the good bits, but anyway. So, this is part one, and obviously after this will be part two. Anywho, so this part one is what it's like to ride from West London to South East London through the city, across the river at Greenwich, and over the river as it were, and then out onto the A2, I think it is, it's, it's going to take me, uh, and what that's like for any of you that have never done that before. So we're going to go west, city, southeast, yeah, southeast, just give me a map, map right in my head. Um, so off we go. Let's see what happens, eh? See you on the other side of South East London. going to quickly butt in on this one. Um, also, um, as promised to motocovers.com, I'm trying out a, a customised or just extended really, slightly bigger uh, sheepskin cover on my uh, not incredibly comfortable NC750X uh, seat. Honda, if you're listening, sort it out. Too many people complaining about it. But so far, touch wood, um, in the couple of weeks I've had it, um, it's working out all right. So this is a big test, it's like 80, 90 miles or so, uh, a couple of hours in the seat. Um, so this should really give it a good test. Okay, back to the silent viewing.
just a quick catch up. We're now in um, Holborn. Uh, didn't do that too badly. A um, couple of little niggles there with a black cab who thought we could just cut me up. But that's the problem with being 20 only. Um, I hit 20 really quick. Not a lot I could do really. He has to give way to the right. The obstruction's on his right, on his left, sorry. Just being an arse. Black cab bully. I think they own the fucking roads in London. That's, that hasn't changed in 40 years, believe me, when I was doing dispatch riding up here all the time. It was always the same. Just because they earn their living up here doesn't mean they own the roads. And as a so-called professional driver, they should know that. But just because you earn your living at something doesn't mean you're professional. Technically it does, but not in the mind. Anywho, enough of renting. We're on a jolly day out. Jolly boys out into Mar oh, okay. Sorry, Mr. Dellboy. Place I know well, up here. And she's going to throw me across the river. <laughs> Doris, that is. What I call Google Maps. So she's going to throw me across the river here. So we're going to go into South East London. And then we'll pick up the A2, I believe. If you're still with me, <clears throat> back in again. Um, so that was nice over the bridge there, wasn't it? All the, all the main sites of London. Um, but I've not been over this side for a long time. What's this Waterloo Station? I've not been here for a long, long, long time. So uh, let's enjoy this bit together, eh? But just so you know, and you can probably tell by that road, the cut over there, this is South East London. It's the first postcode, South East 1. Just over the water, uh, blah, blah, blah. Was that Waterloo Bridge? Yeah, it must have been. Um, so here we are in South East London. It didn't take too long actually, I left at 8, quarter past 8, it's now 8.51, so that wasn't too bad, was it? Really? So yeah, let's enjoy this, eh? See what we've got in South East London, eh? It gets quite a bad rap, South East London, but I suppose everywhere has got its issues, its good points. Can't be all bad everywhere. Well, certain countries I suppose it could be, but not in Blighty.
it's in the air. So that sort of indecisive moment, you know, where you have your visor down or up. I think when I get on the A2, I think it's definitely down. <laughs> I won't be filming my return journey because that's um, going to be via the M2, M25 again, so there's no point. But I'm definitely going to be getting home quicker. A lot of roadworks around here. So what do we have? In summary, so I've been doing it up a bit since I've been here. Not here, because these flats have always been here. But I don't think I've missed much. You're not coming over here in a long time. I can't remember when the last journey over this way was but it was a long time ago so yeah hmm cars on fire <laughs> look at that, that call the fire brigade quick <laughs> Red lights are not for cyclists. Okay. Fair enough. And now we're cruising on to the A2. So we will soon be going over the, into the A2. So this is the London portion, the through London portion. Hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed my little remarks, commentary. If not, hey ho. What do you think? Is this 20 mile an hour max a hindrance? 30 mile an hour on flyovers? Or is it as it should be? You have your say below. Love you all. Like and subscribe and I'd love you better. And see you in part two where hopefully we arrive in Margate and enjoy the uh, scooters and the music and the festivities that that will bring and hopefully a bit of sunshine although it is planned for sunshine in two or so hours so all good again once again i have lots of love to give so love you all and see you in the next one ta-ta for now <laughs>